In this video, what we're going to do is just go over the steps of downloading the Ester Synchronization Planner from the Iowa Beef Center website. And um, what you want to do, of course, is be at www.iowabeefcenter.org. Okay, when you're there, we're on our way. Go to Tools, go to Software, find the Ester Synchronization Planner, and it'll take us to the site that has the planner on it. Now there's two versions. There's the original version right here and then there's the multi-group version right below it. Now the original version can run on a Mac or a Windows machine. It just requires that you have Excel installed on that computer. The multi-group will only work on a Windows type of machine and you still need Excel. Pick your version. I'm going to use the original version for my example. They both Download the same way. Select the link. Then you're going to have this page that asks you for registration information. And what it is is your name, address, city, state. Okay, so you just go in here. And I got mine kind of pre set up so I don't have to type so much right now. But you want to fill that stuff in. It'll ask you for your email address. And if you have any comments, put them down there and uh, you're going to then hit submit. Now that registration information serves two purposes. One, and when there's updates to the program, I let people know through that uh, email address web thing. The second purpose is that this program has been developed in cooperation with the Beef Reproduction Task Force and every year we have a meeting going through the new technologies and research that have been kind of uncovered in this field of study and we do send out a little note indicating when and where that meeting will be held. It's open to the public for a fee but you do get a, a big dose of beef reproduction technology in that meeting. Okay the next thing then is you'll come to this page and you're going to select where it says download the planner here hit that and you'll notice that it downloads it you can see it going on right there all right once you have the planner downloaded you'll be able to find it in your file explorer so if this little manila envelope that's usually on the taskbar at the bottom if you select that envelope go to this PC then go to your downloads folder and you'll see right here it is okay now I've downloaded it twice. Now the first time you download it, it'll just put it in there like that and it's good to go. If you download it a second time, you'll put this little number behind it. And if you download it three or four more times, you'll just see this number just keeps adding up bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay, it'll still work either way. All right. so now what we want to do is take this file that I've downloaded and put it on my desktop. That way we don't have to download it again. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my desktop. I can get rid of that. So on my desktop, I'm going to right click. I'm going to select new. And then I'm going to select folder. So I've created a folder. And I'm just going to name it Estrus Sync. Okay, and now you'll do this if you do the multi-group one or the standard one. You can do this. Okay. So you got that folder created and then what you can do is select your file here, the S-Sync file, right click it, select cut, then go find your folder here, right click that and select paste. Boom, there it is. Now if you have this window way too big you can't see that folder so be sure you kind of compress it a little bit or you can slide your sides in because you want to be able to see this okay and then once you have that copied you can get rid of that and then from now on all you need to do is just go to your Esther sync folder double click it find your file double click that this it loads Excel first because it's going to use that as a front end to run the software eventually your program comes up. From this point you'll just be sure you enable the editing like that and your program's ready to go.